hello guys welcome to how to fix tech in this video guys if you are not able to run any program as a administrators so in this video we will troubleshoot this issue step by step so first of all guys you need to make sure that you have the admin rights on your windows so in order to check that we need to open here this PC go to search bar type there this PC if uh, or the file explorer you can directly open there and we need to right click on this PC here and go to sh show manage options open the manage option here and once you click on manage option open the local users and groups and click on users now you will see all local users listed here so if I are in my case I have logged in with Dell so how to check that it has the admin rights or not just select that right click and go to its properties once you go to properties go to the member as you can see it has the administrator rights it means that I can run any program with the administrator privilege so make sure you have admin rights on your system if you have user here only user is written here it means that you have only normal standard user rights if both are selected here it means you have I mean the users as well as the administrators that means that Previously, you had the users rights and then you have now admin rights. Okay, so this is a clear now check if it has the admin rights or not. If it does not have, you need to log in with the administrator account and then add that to the administrator groups. Okay, so in the second method, if sometime Windows finds the malicious software you are installing on your Windows, so we need to make sure that the user control setting is set to default how to check that simply open the control panel from here once you open the control panel go to view by and select here the large icons here and then go to user accounts and then go to this option user change account control settings and this should be on the second tier this should not be on the top okay drag it to the second this is the default setting and then click on ok and click on yes and now try to run the command or the any software as administrators and it will fix your issue now okay so these are the two steps to resolve the issue and identify why you are not able to run any program as a administrators Hope this video is useful you guys. If yes, then hit like, subscribe and share. Thank you. Thanks for watching how to fix tech and I will see you in the next video.